presidential elections of the United States in the year 2008 has two excellent candidates, John McCain and Barack Obama, running for this office. In our math course, we'll do some simple calculations using this example to answer some simple questions regarding the outcomes that are likely to come on November 4. So at the moment, the calculations are putting, calculations according to CNN, 264 electoral votes in the blue column, 174 in the red column. And you need 270 electoral votes to win the White House. Now, they are putting these yellow states in the toss-up columns means right now they can go either way with almost equally likely chance. Now the lowest of the lowest contribution that comes from these from any of these seven states is from Nevada that is five which is still is a toss-up so if Nevada goes blue then blue gets how many? 269. One short to win. But 269 is a situation of a tie. In the case of a tie, the matter goes to the house. And the house at the moment, in October 2008, is mostly blue. So if blue gets 269, blue is going to go to white house so if the elections were held today, that is on uh, the 10-12-2008 at this moment, the, and only the toss-up states are going to decide the outcome, then the blue needs only one of the toss-up states to go to the White House. Now the thing is that these states can go blue or red with the same probability and there are many outcomes that the things may turn out to be so let's count how many possible outcomes are there so the seven states each are going to give us two equally likely outcomes red or blue and uh, if we assume that they vote they are going to vote independently of each other, then uh, how many possibilities do we have? We just have to multiply two with itself, how many times? Seven times, and here is the answer, or just take two to the power, seven. How many possibilities you get? 128, okay? So there are 128, equally likely outcomes for the toss-up states. 128 different outcomes out of which only one is giving red for all the states. Okay, So what happens here? Only one out of these 128 are going to show us all red that means at uh, that that means 127 will show at least one blue which will give white house to the blue all right so if the elections were held at this moment therefore if elections were held today that is on October 12, uh, 2008. And uh, if it is all dependent on the toss-up states, and if the toss-up states voted independently, then 127 out of 128 equally likely outcomes fail. 
favor blew to the White House.